Hey guys, it's Mil Mil here and welcome back for the closing stages of The Larger World number 2 Act 1. We cruised through the first four stages fairly easy, of course we had all the zombies in the first four and we're kicking things off with similar fashions here in stage five with the zombies again. We've got a few obstacles coming up now during the later stages, uh, not too concerned about that, I do have all range team members except of course the ally Abraham there who was a melee but other than that I've been making a few headshots um, which we always like those headshots especially when the zombies are around up to now there have been fairly light waves of war because you know you get an aid I think the maximum we had was 10 off the top of my head and of course it's just been trumped there with the 11 walkers but they've been fairly spread out which makes taking care of them that little bit easier but as you can see they've got through the first stage fairly easy got through them ways really comfortably and made the headshots I wanted to make which is good so we're up to stage six now we've got the guys taking on some fire so it looks like we'll verse some people yep and we've got some people and it looks like we're gonna have enemies from all four traits here so we'll just change up the battle items change up our weapons and see how we go. So we had two alerts and two tufts there which we just took care of fairly easy and it will cause four, four alerts against you know at my tufts um, they were just demolished which is also awesome so, and then we've got some strongs and some fast coming in so as I said earlier all traits there we go some tufts and fast but pretty much hitting these guys and they're dying fairly easy which is what we always like to see in these early stages we don't want it to be too tough in the early stages or you know you're going to struggle in the last stages but getting through that fairly easy got through that them five ways really easy five people per wave four at some points took care of them especially all those alerts they were taken care of very quickly which I would hope they would be by my blues and they were now we're going back to zombies so only the one people stage there which is stage six and went back to the zombies for stage seven got a few more obstacles and the zombies is actually starting off closer to you than previous stages so they're getting right up in there and trying to make it that bit more difficult and trying to make those headshots more important to you so if you're not making them and you're struggling to make them then you're gonna get a few walkers onto you very quickly but fortunately right now I am making them headshots and I'm not getting them too close to me and as you can see killing three or two at once with their rushes just to get rid of them which makes it nice and easy it makes this 10 walkers we've got down to one fourth wave we're getting through this stage fairly as well as could almost I could put this on fast forward but I'm not doing it for the sake of the videos um, it wouldn't be very interesting if I was just putting them on fast forward and not actually pressing people so I've not done that but I assume there will be a lot of people out there that just put it on for these first few acts possibly on fast forward until it gets a bit harder and they have to actually start strategically placing their hits and players and get rid of people but at the moment we're just cruising through this making our headshots um, making I guess this looks like a really piece of cake. Um, we've got the obstacles and the zombies starting off close. You know, they're trying to make it that bit more difficult. But when you got a team at, I guess, this higher grade, it's not really hurting you at all. Um, people that are lower and newer to the game are probably going to struggle a little bit. But all you can really do at that stage is just keep grinding away and making your team that bit tougher. And you will eventually get through that and get them through and get them three trainers at the end which will also help you upgrade your players that all that bit more and also I think at the moment in my region we have a faction level up tournament so they're also going to be a crucial part of my faction leveling up points as well which is always awesome oh we just got Jesus popping in which is also oh he's just got the leg up on Sean that's that's epic um so thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it um as always if you liked it hit the thumbs up bye